What's up, my Koopa Troop? It's Koops. And enough. Welcome back to another episode of Mario Plus Rabbit Sparks of Hope. Last oh. episode, we did some more side missions in this back area, in the and, opening area we came and, in. But give us credit, we actually also did another story mission, but yep. it was the story mission that was over on that side of the map, and the story mission the game wants us to do is right over here on this at side of the map. house here. So. We're going to go ahead and follow what the game wants, because we're afraid About it's, time. <laughs> it's going to get us a little mixed up and messed up if we don't do this. Perk of the job, I guess? What job is the resident awful poet? Ooh, ooh, yeah. ooh, sorry. <laughs> There was a rabbit on a piano up there. Oh, there is a rabbit on a piano up there. Beepa, you want to tell us what's up here? Is him and his next magnum opus? Him and a squirrel are playing. Oh, they're doing the whole Tom and Jerry or Bugs Bunny routine on the piano? Playing the piano and then uh, having to compete. Or, no, the squirrel just phases in and out of existence there. Ah. Oh. oh, that's the trick. There's the magic trick right there. That, that's what those old cartoons do. You know, they just, <laughs> the other, the antagonist or whatever of the, the skit, need just phasing in and out of existence. Hey, the feet, but a lot better. The footprints are back, too. Well, you know, you're right. Oh, and this is what skin, you know, would do. It's just show you where to go. But these disappeared last time. Yeah. Where is it taking us, huh? Okay, gang, let's go this up and look for clues and find this is the pile of money that's just laid out here in the open. That was going to take us to the uh, entrance to the, the quest, house. but nope. Nope. Now we will go into the secret passage. We entered here a little bit before, got our power up. The scan. And then left. Ben very. <laughs> yep, and then just like, ah, oh, peace. GG, thanks, thanks for the scan. Oh, Mario's going to just walk through the bookcase. Nice. And now <laughs> we've got the scan. We've done our side missions. We've leveled up. We've trained. We're ready to go. There is pretty much nothing else, much else we can do at the moment, so let's just uh, go about it. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, if he grumbles about it, we're gonna abuse the poor guy, the poor Roomba, get ourselves across. It's just light shining down this one. Is that a statue or an art piece? Maybe, maybe Woodrow also dabbles in some visual art as well. Looks nice. The blue thing on the ground. Huh? I think it's uh, this box to be, or crate to be moved on top of. This crate of, what is it, Nitra? Nitra? <laughs> this looks like Nitra from <laughs> Deep Rock Galactic. Uh, we are in a cave, I think. I'm gonna do some mining. <laughs> Oof, that's one memory I'm not sure I want to take a look at. <laughs> Which was memory? Yeah, digging up some dark secrets about his past or something, perhaps. Ooh, the Fallen King. Kind of sounds like something from like Destiny or something in the yes. game. Yeah. <laughs> mm, but here we have our next story quest, Blight at the End of the Tunnel. Eradicate the darkness puddle in the tunnel. Well, here it is. We found it. Time to get rid of it. Is this what's causing all Woodrow's uh, dark Nightmares. thoughts? Nightmares? Perhaps. We'll find out. We've got Mario, Luigi, and Let's Peach with us. Wait, is that a new enemy? There's a pleader. Ooh, they look like some like mage from a, some sort of like a isekai anime or something like that. You know, or like no, just like some random like background NPC, uh, uh, character from an, from most animes. Aggressive opponent that gets in close and restores some of its health at the expense of its opponents with each successful assault. Its technique allows it to immediately respond to attacks with a counterattack. So it's the exact opposite of the other one. It's ah. like protecting and healing. It gets in close, and it does a lot of damage. The evil counter blow. He attacks immediate counter attack for two. Wait, was that cooldown for? No, it activates for two turns. Oh my gosh! Can we just slide through that though? Is it if we walk in range it goes? I think if we walk in range. What's the range? No, no, no. If we attack it, it will attack us back. But well, we can dash it. I think it's weapon attacks. Okay. I, I mean that's how it worked for Mario. Yeah. But oof! Look at that damage. Thirty percent chance to do eleven hundred damage. We survive some of these hits. What the heck? Um, maybe not poor Luigi. Uh, one. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. There are five of these guys around Luigi here. Luigi can't outrange though. Uh, yes, that's counter, true. Their counter attack. Now we did decide to go and boost up uh, Luigi's movements at the sacrifice of his Steely Stare. Yeah. Uh, there's some because there were a lot of those ghost ghostly walkers that we saw last episode. And they're immune to Steely Stares. Mm -hmm. Now, however, the stage share would be great against these guys because as they walk closer, he just blasts them before they get close. Yeah. However, let's still go with what we've got. I don't think it's the ideal situation, but 
but I'm curious to see how this high ground damage does. We true, we did high ground. Damage. Yes, and there's actually a bit of high ground right there. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Now that is to say, you know, we can still steely stare. And in fact, when you steely stare on top of, oh, that's not high ground. It looks higher up in the, yeah, and not camera. Though. There's high ground above some of the enemies. Oh, maybe over there. Yeah. And Luigi can definitely get over there. I'm pretty sure. Well, Luigi jumps. can double team jump. Yeah, and so, every time he team jumps, he gets a dash. So I wonder if maybe how do we prop it up? With that? Well, we can also focus on one of them. They haven't activated anything yet. No, so. right? We can take one out. That'd be great. It's part of the objective. There is some only some partial cover. I'm also there. assuming you could maybe go invisible, shoot him, and it will not counterattack, like it did for hmm, that's Edge true. before. You're right. They wouldn't be able to do anything about that. <laughs> they have a lot of health too, 2,000 practically. Yeah, why do they need that much health? They already do a lot of damage. They do a lot on the heal. No, that's not great. Right. Okay. Mm. Well, let's, I mean, let's go. Let's uh, choose a side and let's move. What do you think? If you can get Leech at the center. Remember, Peach gives a barrier, whoever she jumps off of. That's true. So. She should team jump off of Mario, then Mario comes back and team jumps off of her, maybe. And Luigi goes after and team jumps up for both. And then you get a couple dashes that way. What do you think? Maybe you can try to take you on this yep. side here? Yeah, let's do it. There's also another defender back there. But if we all kind of get behind this cover here, they couldn't get to us. So, all right, let's do that. You also can power up this turn with uh, Peach if you want to. What else is she going to do? Um, and fire. Or try yeah, out the new me. spark, which will knock off the enemy. I'd be down to try it. I wonder if there's a spot she could get to the knockoff. Looks like she could definitely knock them off in both directions. At least these two depleters. Yeah. If you got in between. Yeah, I have to get right in between. Well, what if you team jump and go towards that foot pad there? Hmm. So just team jump off of Mario, let's say. Okay. Land right here. Maybe we dash this guy. Sure. We have well, two do we, dashes. Do we want to boost? You have two dashes. So. Yeah, but do we want to boost? No, we, I guess we're going to try the spark out, actually. So we want to boost. Now, now go on this side. And you're going to use the spark. Oh, yep. Yeah, right. Make sure they don't bounce back and hit you. Well, that guy's got partial cover back there or something. You'll bounce back and forth. I wonder if a slight angle will. All right, let's give it a shot and see where they go. All right. Or even how the spark works. Oh, that guy actually went way further. Around. So it does do all three hits, and then they go rolling really far. Yeah. And that worked actually great. Our angle worked. The guy bounced mm -hmm. off the partial cover. Then out of bounds. Yeah. And so did this. Well, he didn't even bounce off. No, he, he just went right out of bounds. bounds. Yeah. And out of bounds is 270. And actually, I think every time he hit an a wall, they he did 10. 10 damage. It's yeah, not much, not but much. it does. They do some damage. And I think if they run to other enemies and such, they'll also like take. They'll bounce damage. into them and they'll take some damage too. Yeah. So okay. Let me keep in mind. Well, now Mario can. Hold on. Just give some room for a Peach. She can vault over. She should be able to. Yeah. Okay. Oh. There we go. So now she can help others team jump and such. Like Mario, Luigi. Oops, sorry, go ahead. Well, Mario was going to say could just go stomp this guy. Come back and help Luigi, who can also dash this guy up to three times. Well, he can just dash another guy three times. Oh, that too. Yeah, we can just save your, just save your dashes, I think. Ooh, yeah, because I think every time he team jumps, he'll get a dash, I think a dash charge. I don't know if it's a dash charge or he has to use it after a team jump, but we'll have to we'll we'll figure find it out. out. Yeah, we'll find out. So we'll have Mario just go ahead and stomp this guy. Yeah, I think just stomp him twice or three times actually. Maybe three times. He's, maybe he's dead. And then maybe he'll be just done. And I'll try to get Mario and landing back over towards that jump pad there. Sure. Ooh, he can. Hmm. Or should we just have him go over that way? Well, no, I should probably finish this guy off. Okay. Because Luigi's gonna go over the go over too. No, didn't finish him off. Okay. And shoot. Yep, just want to make Finish sure. the first guy, and then it does more damage to the second one. Do we have that? No, we don't have that. Okay. Well, that's still good. That's a, yeah, it costs a lot of points, but we have this though. And now we're done. Okay, we can get to that. Awesome. And we can slide someone. We can, after jumping across, we can slide yep. that guy. 
Um, in fact, you can just, just go ahead. You can just go ahead right now. We're just gonna go over there too. You can just go ahead now if you wanted to. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Nice okay. crits. Awesome. And then we also have this either a hero sight or go invisible, but probably hero sight. Or shot. Well, you are shot, so probably, yeah. Yeah. Now, Luigi. So he's got one, so let's team jump off Peach and go to probably the, the pad. We'll go to the pad, yep. <laughs> he, I think it, it, looks it, like it, just, it just gives a charge. Wow. Okay, that's actually quite nice. So then Luigi could dash this guy three times. Yes, if he, after he goes to Mario. After he goes to Mario and team jumps off of him, yes. And is there one down there we can get a high ground advantage off of? Plus, did two dashes kill this guy, or do you need all three? Yeah, I'm gonna. Need, I'm gonna need at least three. No, it's gonna be another shot needed. Oh, Peach well, has Peach has fired. Peach has yeah. fired, or Mario's hero sight will kill that thing, and his counter attack should not go off, or maybe it will. Not sure how that works. He has to activate it first. But Peach hasn't fired yet, so so she can just like you know blast. get over to here. And okay. Blast. Okay. Yeah, that would be enough. Oh, so actually, Luigi just dash once, or let's have Peach shoot first. Maybe, maybe, she, that maybe out. she kills. All right. I don't think it. Even with a crit, she does not. So never mind. Yeah. But this is a good spot for her. That's still a good spot. So let's do it. Yeah. Lay out Mario. Low damage. I'm glad that in this game you don't do damage to other heroes. It was, you know, really tricky to get that to work out, and it did hurt her quite a bit in terms of like actually being useful. All right. Well, now Luigi. But Luigi should dash be able to... one. Dash twice. Not... Dash twice. All right. Oh, well, Team Jump of Mario, where do we want to go is the question. Hmm. Is there anyone we can keep high ground? We have high ground on the guy above, straight ahead of us. And that one over there. Oh, yeah. Actually, you know what? No. Wait. Oh, but I have to get a bit closer. I have to go to here. <laughs> Look at that damage, though. It's 15. See, it's saying it's guaranteed 1540. Because guaranteed 1540 because of the high ground. High yeah. Uh, but there is this flaming stooge over here. Now, if you team jump towards that flaming stooge, you get a slide him, but we don't get to do anything else to him, right? Yeah. No, that's true. Because Mario's already sh shot. Well, how about you have. I mean, I guess you could team jump. It doesn't matter if we don't use the slide, I suppose. Or we team jump to get behind this cover here. And then we both Hero Sight and Seely Sarah. That guy tries to move to get to a better shot to shoot Luigi, but then they both shoot him. Instead. Yeah. That's fine. It is, we just don't get to use the, the that extra slide. dash. That's fine, though. Doesn't, yeah. It doesn't matter. Just actually, hold on. Mario can get a little closer. I see what you're saying. But there's not really. But there's not really a reason we don't really want to take the damage from the fire. No. Plus, that guy might fire first. I don't think he would. But he. Uh, he had. Yeah. Then he moved. I think he gives okay. Up. I guess go behind that full cover here. Yeah. Here but remember, you also want to keep as much range as possible to get more damage. Yeah. And then fire at. No, not zero percent. Maybe just stay where you were. I guess stay here. Here. Can we hit that oh, guy? Well, I can't still hit that guy. That's right. I had to go out in the open. I don't really want that, even if it's great damage. Can you shoot that guy ahead of us? Straight away? No. Not within range. Still not within range. Only if I get out in the open again. Unfortunately, you really don't want to go in the open because the guy might fire first, right? Yeah. I guess here, just go here and can we shoot? Can't shoot, shoot a new one. Can you go into the full cover and shoot the guy? Yeah, that's a bit, good bit of damage to him. Okay. Um, there's also this. We could pull that guy forward and have Mario shoot with a hero sight. That won't kill, though. And then he's closer to Luigi. Yeah, uh, true. I think just Luigi shoot him, and then we put Steely Stare and a Hero Sight, and no one else can get close enough to do anything. Yeah. Do anything yet, anyways. All right. So. All right. We probably end up wasting shots on this guy. Ooh, nice. Great wow, damage. Great. Though. Wow. That's really good. Mario, Mario goes there. Let me just go to here so we can get a little closer. Hero Sights. When the guy gets the as soon as he sees him, he'll shoot him. Yep. I think Silly Stair's fine here. I mean, if that guy dies, hopefully to Mario first would be ideal. Yeah. And then someone else moves and Luigi shoots them. Yeah. But we can't predict. Yep, can't guarantee that. Worst happens is Luigi shoots this guy, Mario's hero sight goes to waste. waste. Yep. 
but that's probably what's going to happen. All right, let's... Looking good. Let's end our turn. Yep. Okay, and... Yep. Oh, Luigi didn't shoot that. I'm surprised. He still is out of range. Luigi only has one Celia Sear. We had to, oh, we had we to, had take, to take that out. That's yep, right. So it all went to waste. Yep. Like we thought. So I guess maybe Mario should have been closer for that. Or Luigi shouldn't have put up Celia Sear. Maybe. Maybe that would have been the right play. Yeah. Now this thing here, we can shoot it yeah. early. We should. But it's just yes. going to bring in. It's not going to bring in the enemy that we need to defeat them. Well, how many are left in the field? Three. Three over that way? And they're all over that way. They barely move forward. Okay. Well, let's have Luigi definitely keep them locked in by blocking them. He's going to just run all the way back over here. <laughs> She'll want to jump off someone, give them their barrier. Yeah. And then Luigi probably goes last to get the double jump. Okay. Can Mario go... Can Peach jump off of Mario? Hmm. Go to the platform. Now, Mario can also turn invisible, too. So he can get up close. I think, yeah, we'll have him go up close and shoot and slide and all that, and stomp and all that stuff, and then yeah. probably go invisible. So then actually maybe Luigi should get the barrier. He can already make, yeah, he can already make the platform. Peach can't go anywhere, so she needs to jump off somewhere. Yeah. So, yeah, you can give it to Luigi. And they all can... Okay, Luigi can make that, but Mario can't. He'll have to jump off if Luigi is... Yes, he'll have to jump off Luigi. He can still stomp after he does a couple of those jump pads. Yes. All right. So Peach will go forward. We'll yep. all go that way. Yeah, because we want to give Luigi his high ground to the left. We want to get away from this portal. Yep. Okay. And uh, hmm, where to go here? I guess just back just there by that guy. Straight here. We want to get rid of this guy. Luigi does not want to shoot this guy back here. No. He can help it. He now, could... do we want to? Do we want to power up this turn? We yeah, we that? should actually, but we'll get them all over, over there first. first. The thing is, though, Luigi might go that way instead. Wait, which one? Or no. Okay, never mind. No, he's going to go up here. Okay. He wants high ground. No, don't slide yet. Let's turbocharge in a little bit. All right. So now, Mario's going to need to bounce off of Luigi. Yep. Oh, actually, you need to... Ah. Don't do Mario's thing yet, because we want Turbo Charge. Ah, we'll land here. But I'll have Luigi. Yeah, we'll also go. go over here this way. Yep. Hi, Luigi. There we go. And then now. he can team jump to be in Turbo Charge now. Yes. Now Mario can go and do a stomp to turn out Turbo Charge. Yes, you're right. Good call, good call. So a stomp, stomp, and then while we're in the air, maybe shoot at that guy? Yeah, I think so. Anything else? Because then Peach can shoot this guy next to us and finish him off. Yeah. We're going to do a lot of damage, by the way. <laughs> yes. So I don't even know if we need all of this, but... Okay, nice and we go. And shoot this other guy twice. twice. I was hoping to go further to go... Nah. To go slide. Now you can slide that guy. I guess you might as well. Yep. Peach maybe can save her shot if she slides him, too. Yeah, I think so. Or obviously, it's Luigi still has a slide too. Peach just slide finish. Oh, she's got two slides, so she'll finish her. So she'll finish him off. Okay. Can she shoot anyone? Uh, yes. Yeah. I think just I think we'll have go she ahead. Go ahead. Can't do jump it. anymore. She can't jump. Can't we jump. Need, we don't need this. We don't, I don't need think. barrier. We can just go ahead and do this. And then. Mario's already shot. Can he shoot that guy? Can he do something to hit that guy too? No. Well, unless you throw a power block. No, I won't but do Luigi, it. But Luigi um, wants to stay, oh, stay up here right and shoot yep. from there. Now, hold on. Where can Luigi shoot this guy? It's 50 50. See, I think it's all you can do. Unless he goes to the high ground next one over. Like he flies over to that weird block thing in the middle. Yeah, I'm wondering. Yeah, he can team jump off. Okay, I, th I think I got it. You can team jump once, then team jump again to go to there, and then jump up there. Yeah, you can go fly over here and get he'll be two a, team he'll jumps. Be, unfortunately, he's a bit close to that guy. But it'll be 100% crit, so it'll be a bit more damage. Well, if we're worried about that, we also can just sit back here and wait for him to get closer. Yeah, that's true. Fire? Yeah, let's just fire. Nice. Now have Luigi come over to Mario and Peach? Yep. 
We also can dance that guy over if we wanted to. You know, that's true. Maybe he goes over and dances the guy out of cover? Not this guy, the other guy. Over there. Get give, give two team jumps first. You can, you can team jump here and then team jump there. And then or, team... hold on, Mario. No, oh, just sorry. team jump real quick off Mario. Or off Peach, but it doesn't matter. And just land right back down again. <laughs> and then team jump off Mario and go. All the way to that. That, big, that weird platform? Yep. Or on the ground, I guess. You yep. can't go all the way. I can also dash this Yeah, I do, have a, I do have a lot of range. Actually, you know, I could just jump. Well, no, Mario. Mario, with this guy, I think you just slide this guy and kill him. Yeah, take him out. We have right. no more shots. Right. Okay. Now, now I can't jump and maybe get to that platform and then go over. Well, I was thinking we just dance him out of cover. Right here. Well, he's. He'll get closer, I think, towards Luigi. Yeah. And yeah. then Luigi can retreat back and fire. Back, there. back there with high ground. Hmm. Okay, we can try that. Yeah, let's do it. I don't think he kills, but I think he makes this guy's life pretty miserable. Yep. Let's try it. Okay. Um. <laughs> huh. Do they actually come all the way to where you are, no matter what? No. no. What? Oh, because it, it was like a time limit to it. But they're gonna go. They're gonna go next. Is what, is what it They're is. They're going to try to get to Nexia as, as much as... Okay, well, Luigi can still hide back over that way, I guess. He doesn't get high ground anymore, so he can't kill. But you can go back to cover. Uh, back by them, I guess. Ooh, hold on. Yeah, you, get to the, you just get to the stairwell, or the pathway. And he can get to that high ground, that one block. I guess jump back that way? Yeah. Well, that's a bit of a bummer, unfortunate, but... uh. Thanks. And then should be a shot on him. That's still a lot of damage. Wow. Would have been a guaranteed kill with the, the chance, yeah, but. In terms of chance? Oh well. Yeah. Don't get her hopes to like this game. Yeah. Oh, that was. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, and now Mario hides. Now people are going to come out of the other thing, so you just go ahead and full cover there. Yeah. Alright. What else does he have? He could go invisible if he really wanted, but. No, you've got nothing else he can do. No. You can just go invisible if you want for now. Sure. And then just hang out. I, I mean, it doesn't matter. Yeah. But right. just, just so there's one less person to get hit by anything. Yep. Let's go. Ooh. All right. Oh, he, he has counter up. He's got his counter. So it doesn't matter. Luigi can just shoot, I think, out of range, out of his counter. Think so? Or Mario can fire and he's invisible, right? Yeah. <laughs> Just team jump off of uh, Peach real quick. Yeah, you know what? That's, that's that does more damage, I think. Yep. You're right. Where's your counter, buddy? Hey, oh, counter, if you're dead. <laughs> So we didn't get to see their counter in action, but that worked out fairly well. Learned yeah. a little bit more about the dance. So it actually, they will always go next to you, yep. they, no matter how the route nope. is. But they yep. do have a time limit in how much they can yes. move. Yes, right. So that guy went, the, the thing is, that was about one of the longest routes you ever could possibly take. Right. So I don't think it'll be happen too often. That's actually different than the previous game, which is just like it just they get they'll try ish, they go towards the way, but it's like if they're kind of behind cover locked. already, they'll just stick back there. They'll, stick back there. they'll get stuck. If they no. see a pipe, they won't go through it. I mean, they just a lot of weird things. This looks like it's a little bit more consistent, right? That they're always gonna walk next to you as far as close as close to as they can within that time limit. All right, because so far everyone else has walked literally the space away from us. Right, right, as close as they could to the hero. They used it now. You might be asking why we had that on Luigi. We don't actually really want to use it on Luigi, but the passive for that thing is Attack Master, which gives us extra a, weapon damage. Extra weapon damage. And as you saw there, it was quite a lot. Oh. I guess triangle yep. first? No, the triangle first. is over in the. We need circle first. Oh. Okay. We get up to here. Anything around here? Ah, yep. You're in the oh. way. <laughs> Can I move it? Just throw it down. Oh, hold on. Maybe I if I push it down. There we go. Awesome. Easy. Makes sense to me. Hold on. Yay! 
What about this? Oh no, that, never mind. Wait, was that that one weird statue, right? That was. Or was that weird statue actually just part of that dark mess thing? We I think out? it might have been part of the dark mess. Oh, it was, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah, well, okay. I was, I, I was thinking about it. I was like, that was a weird statue to have. It, it here, was but... weird, but I think it was a darkness weird. Well, and speaking of weird, Luigi and Peach just teleported. <laughs> well, they got, they got stuck and they had to catch up. So, yeah, they were just using their, you know, the powers of teleportation. Hmm. All right. Well, that takes care of this underground area. Let's head on out. Not too shabby. We'll see on Luigi's Steely Stair, though I did like the extra dashing. That was, I, it is interesting. I so like the way, the way it read is that you would team jump, land, then have to dash, then team jump again. That was my initial thought. Mm -hmm. But real in reality, it's just team jump twice and you have two extra dashes. You yeah. can use whenever. I like how it's just like, where's the secret passage? It's just the do not, do not enter, enter sign. <laughs> it's like, again, the guests in a, a, a Rikos Tycoon game. Yep. Oh, can't go that way <laughs> nope. ever. There's a do not enter. Nice, we got ourselves a five pole. Palco flag. Okay. What's going on here, Rabbit? Excuse me. Please save us! That technical puts all future Apple Presents and Palette Villa at great risk! Ooh. Apple Presents? We can't have that. Gotta preserve the uh, Apple Presents. The business. Well, there's a. There's a guy down there. Hold on. Guy's also there. A green ring. But we can't challenge. get to it yet. No. Looks like we're gonna have to take care of some dark mess dark around mess here. Dark mess. Or do it. What's? Who's inside the house? Not Gok. <laughs> Don't mind us. Just heroes coming in. I do see a cellar, outside to the left. Oh yeah. Oh, and here is here it is. Oh. A young Woodrow is reciting his first poem just before the great tree blight of Palad Prime strikes. Hmm. Oh no. No coincidence. So it's like comic book style. It took 500 leaf blowers to tidy up afterwards. Residents were fined a million coins due to the... A North million? A million? What is this? Some sort of like bean bean kingdom like currency exchange like thing going on here? Like I, I think it's like a Arlong pirates type thing going oh. on. They like just find them a million coins and they're like, you'll live for... You'll never pay it off ever because we have yep. 2,000, by the way. So yeah, we're not even right? close. We've been collecting a lot of coins. That's uh, that's a lot of money. Uh, use the secret you know scanner. What? Yeah, let's... Okay. I was I use the secret scanner, but I don't think there'd be anything in there. I didn't think there was anything in there. Oh, so it just comes out didn't here. Didn't see any contextual clues. Yep. The scan. Yeah, I don't think you have to walk around actually doing that too often. Can we jump down from here? Nope. Is there a bridge maybe? Nope. Whoa. But there is an egg thing. The eye. Right. Yep. But we can't get to it. We have to go around, looks like. This is just. So what's the point of this area if we can't jump down? Uh, I guess just a nice little view of this back area to kind of plan your route out through the town, perhaps? I suppose. So we go mm. down to their cellar, then back up again. Yeah. <laughs> Weird. Okay, well, I guess this was the Woodrow's old house. Perhaps. It also said, like, uh, I think I had, like, the Woodrow hat number one. So yeah, I saw that number looks one. Looks like it's a series of paintings of his escapades or Too his deep. misadventures perhaps Ooh. Hello, I thought you were a citizen hmm. uh, so you can we can take him out Yay! just because he's a little bit annoying yep. sure now these are the no it's not these guys these are magicians so are these ma yeah magicians so they don't but they don't have the ability to just ignore steely stairs and hero sites I am missing the double steely stair that would have Taking out all those guys. True, uh, but, but the, having the extra dashes, though, from team jumps is pretty nice. And we do have a bit of high ground here to work with. More depleters. Luigi might not even move here. Yeah, you know, he might just park here. This is the funny thing. To get that double dash and movement, you have to go pretty far down the movement tree. Yeah. In though in reality, this is one of the ones where Luigi wants to probably just end up sitting. <sighs> right? Hmm. Is it worth it to change the skill tree for just that? It's not, because... There's only partial cover so they can get to him. Yeah. So he's going to want to. Well, we don't to. even have City Star with the ghost sight, so yeah, he can't shoot through the objects. But I think we'll be fine regardless. Let's go. Plus, we could have Luigi actually go and... There's only two depleters, so right, if we, we could... boost up our power and go find them... Yeah. Where are they? They are... Both hiding back on that side of the map. We can't get down and get to that jump platform, which gets us to the middle, but we're kind of stuck there. But if we can take out the depleters. Can we do it all in one turn? I 
I think, think we could. so. But we do need to get that depleter to get a bit closer. Here's my thought. If we can get, if we can jump down, maybe even, like, Luigi can go last. But if he can go, he can actually, he can do the disco dance. Yeah. Glitter dance and pull them all to the middle. That'll get that one guy out of cover. Then he could maybe team jump back out. I think that I think that could work. Yeah, let's try that. So let's have maybe Mario go down because he can boost, stomp. I would boost first with oh, Peach good. while they're all just here and it's easy. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Hmm. Can he fly somewhere to do this? Or does Peach want to go first because she can give the barrier and someone can bounce off of her later? Does Peach go down, jump off that thing, land on the top area? I think she can jump down later too. I don't know if she can jump down and get the round, or at least just she could fire at something. Yeah. All right. Well, we can try. Because we want to team jump off her to get Mario's stomp. Yeah. I think. Yes. So we can. She just... also can gust potentially if she didn't want to shoot. But true. Um. But we can jump up there and. Yeah. Uh, like you said, then Mario can also stomp and whatever. And we can get back there. Cool. All right. Nice. So Mario next. Mario next. You just make it. I probably just made it. Oh, over. Yeah, you're right. Sorry. Probably should have done that. It's okay. Oh, hold on. I can do it again. I can just go down and do it again. Oh, and do it again. Gotcha. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Well, just to save the potential team jump. For, right. To you're, get to the other guy. Oh, hold on. Who's the who's the leader? Is this guy? Right here. Yeah, it's okay. the guy right there. So you can get over and stomp. Actually, I can, all, I, can I can dash him out. Yeah, I do that. We're trying to save our team jump in case we need it for some other reason. Yeah. This one here, Peach is going to have a slide and a shot on. Ooh, it's at the very edge of the range there. It's kind of tricky because I think maybe I can fly over it. Hold on, Peach. Can you move out of the way a sec? You can fly around the thing too a little bit. Nice. And then hang out right around there. Okay, that works. Yep. Because Luigi can... Um, I think now Luigi goes forward and Glitter dances that guy out of cover. All right. So now everyone can take a shot at him. We want to put Park Luigi in a spot that he can Glitter dance the guy, but it comes to him. So maybe out in the open? Right, that far, so up maybe behind that cover there. Yeah, or that partial cover, over there. Yeah. Yeah, in the middle there. Okay. Oh, that not that far. Here. Okay. Yeah. Does get him. So they'll all. He should run around, and then hopefully we can all come take pot shots Hold at on. him. Actually, I want to make sure they don't get behind this cover. So like Luigi yeah. can get up there and do some extra damage. Okay. Too. This should be better. Let's we'll see what the guy does on top, too. I'm interested if he jumps down and comes around. Oh, yeah, he should. Let's see it. So we're using Luigi as bait. <laughs> this is what we're doing, which is kind of weird. You don't really want to. Yeah, he does. Let's jump down. This guy does come to the spot. They get as close as possible. <laughs> They're really unfused together there. And now Luigi just dashes just the guy. We don't need to worry about them. He has one more team jump, too, by the yep. way, for another so dash. Yep, for another dash. And that's fine, because we can get uh, everyone down there actually to do that. He can go down. She has, in fact, we, she has a team jump. Actually, do we want Luigi to even... Hmm. Yeah, she does have a team jump. She has a team jump, so she can get closer and double dash. She has two dashes. Yep, so here, Peach. Team jump closer. Double dash, park next to him, just blast him. Probably is actually, actually GG could be then. GG, yeah. That guy's gone. And we can go what, about our, what about our blast? Does it kill already? Yes. Do we kill the guy next door? I guess I have Luigi. For extra, yeah, for some extra star bits, why not? So have Mario to shoot the guy? Sure. Or no, not yet. Luigi can team jump. For a slide on who? Not a slide. He can get back up top here for extra damage. It doesn't matter. It's over. Oh, yeah, true. Just, so just have Mario shoot the other guy. You can just shoot from down here. If you want, you have Luigi team jump to see if he can yep. one shot someone else from up high. Oh, you know what? I, I don't mm, know if he has range on anyone. Maybe. Is there any spot? See a zero percent uh, here. 
And he one shot the guy. Oh, yeah, he can. All right, just do it. Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and do that. Oops, sorry. Nope. There we go. This is for star bits. Star bits, yep. Why not? You can extra star bits this way. And now Peach. Blast them both. Blast them both. Oh, there we go. Wow. Nice job, everyone. Never really thought of using Luigi as the bait, but it's kind of, maybe it's kind of like, uh, you know, in Scooby-Doo where they have like Shaggy go out as the bait. Well, he's a good runner. He's got a lot. He can cover a lot of distance pretty quickly. And I prefer someone else. <laughs> it's because we're not using a steely stare as we can use the bait. And it's also because right. he has amazing movement. Yeah. Off team jumps and yep. double team jumps. Mm -hmm. And this level, this world has jump pads. Pads. So he's got the best movement out of everyone in the game right now for After us, jumping. I think, probably. Oh, it's those weird. Oh, from like, not Kleptos, but I forget what they're called. From like, Mario. From yeah, Mario 3D World. I didn't, you know, you never actually see them outside of the main game, do you? Yeah, I, I, this is interesting. I'm surprised they're just here. Right. Curse's Army has no appreciation for our quaint, old fashioned small town charm. Help us! What are you selling? Oh, what are you, just, wooden bowls? At least you're selling really? something. Yeah, I mean, I guess it's better than the one guy back here who was, seemed to be selling leaves <laughs> <laughs> from his cart. <laughs> What's over here in this house? Can we actually get into the house? It looks like it's all boarded up. Boarded up. You got anything in your yard buried? The other uh, secrets. Still more rocks covers. on the ground, but those are clearly another secret. It's, yep, another thing we can't do yet. Ooh, there is, however, this giant. Oop! Oh, cutscene. Oh, well, there goes that house. There goes the neighborhood. Somewhere just in Marvin, the destruction work there. Oh! Uh. Bowser? It's a Bowser. B -b Bowser. And it's block rabbit. Oh! Oh, I thought you got punched in the face. Kind of getting some Bowser's inside story vibes from this fight. Of course, you gonna fall for it? Oh no! So long, gay Bowser! No, not the flying bench press! Oh wait, she's picked up a steel chair! That round fella? <laughs> Friend of yours? Uh, no? You could say an acquaintance. Oh, mama! We could ask you the same about that stone to face, other, but oddly attractive a woman. <laughs> Spark Hunter. Name's Bedrock, and she's no friend of mine. Hmm. Bowser's no friend of ours either. Does a lot of kidnapping of Princess Peach. Still, we can't leave him to the dark mess, can we? Princess Peach, Princess Peach is thinking, oh yes we can. <laughs> we can definitely leave him. Yeah. We don't have to always save Bowser too. Right? Well, that was a bit unexpected, although not totally unexpected to see Bowser in the game because he's on the cover of the game Is box. He? Yes. Oh, I didn't know that. Kind of hidden in the corner, though, but yeah, he's he's there. <laughs> but yeah, okay. First time seeing him. He's right. He's getting kicked around, though, thrown, thrown into the darkness. He'll probably be okay, though. He'll probably be okay. I think we can go check out some of these houses first. <laughs> There's the house you just walked by that also had a door, I think, oh, too. Oh, okay. We'll check that as well. Yeah, Hello. Bowser, you'll be fine. We're here for your stuff. That's number three. Oh. Here's as many as a tear in the village park. Can you do something? And uh, nope, sorry. <laughs> We've tried nothing and just all <laughs> and we're all out of ideas. <laughs> Let's go back to the other house. That one was number three. Hopefully this other house has number two. You're right. We want to know all about Witcher's life in chronological order. Bowser's like, hello. <laughs> hello, bit drawn in the dark mess right here. <laughs> Okay, you know, I guess fair. I did try to kidnap the princess a bunch of times. We've been rivals, enemies, those whole way through every game, most of the games, and whatever. <laughs> I'm an expert in four combat, but even I won't go near that tentacle of my advice. Buy some POW blocks. That's actually some pretty good advice, but... I wonder if there's going to be a bunch of eyes together again, which is where POW blocks come in handy. Oh, maybe, yeah. As a group thing. That's, that's good advice. Woodrow's poem, The Strange and Conflicting Feelings of the Crofter's Cheesemonger, preceded an alien invasion. What? 
What? I see that alien crashing in the background there. Yeah. The entire planet was forced to harvest thousands of pounds of pumpkin spice in exchange for their freedom. Horrible. Some rabid lore going on? Yeah. Also done in like this um is Bill Watterson. Yes. Our style. Yeah. Kevin Hobbs. Yeah. It is. I really like it. That's really well done. But yeah, there's definitely some big lore going on right here. What also what is this over here in this painting? This pi or picture frame here. I can't quite is it is it the rabbit holding like a stuffed rabbit? It, it is. is Squeezing this? a stuffed rabbit. Hmm. With, and they've got uh wallpaper with some acorns on it. Hmm. Hopefully it doesn't turn to be like that rabbit's crazy and think that stuffed rabbit is his wife or whatever. <laughs> Probably <laughs> is. Hmm. We'll just uh, leave him be then. He gives good advice, but might not have the best of company. All right, let's go check out artist work number three on Woodrow's uh, depressing life. <laughs> oh. um. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. What? Oh, what? That? That? Right in the middle. Wait, wait. wait what? <laughs> Where are you, where are you going? I decided to walk out the door. It just noped out of that. You had it for a second. How did that even work? Like, why? What? That was apparently closer to the door than the painting. Come on. No, you gotta get it. Hold on. Walk Maybe towards it straight. Nope. It was there for a second. I saw the A. No? What is going on? This guy's text, I think, is in the way. In the way. There we go. Wow, that was wait. After Woodrow read his next poem, a luxury space cruiser crashed into a satellite. Debris fell from the sky for quite a while. Wait, including weights, pianos, so like all the cartoon sort of heavy objects fall from the sky. Where's the anvil? Yeah, <laughs> right. There's an oh, iron. Oh, found. there's an iron though. Okay, yeah. Rabbits would be having a picnic and then BAM! Down would come some crystal hot tub or gold badminton cabinet. You know, I haven't seen those done in a cartoon yet, but uh, ouch. I just wonder <laughs> if it's our junk pile, once again from Rabbits Go Home, that's crashing down. Uh, uh, look at this artwork. Like, look at the, just to the right of the weight, those two rabbits holding onto each other tightly for dear life. There's, that's probably where the anvil is coming down, or the giant weight that just yeah. says like 10 ton or whatever. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Wow. So every time this guy reads a poem, destruction happens on a worldwide scale. Mm -hmm. So he needs to stop reading poems. Right? Let's check out number, I'm assuming, five or four here. Or not. That's not a door that we can enter? Nope. I guess it's... Uh, this was a house. That would be a way to go, except there's darkness covering all over the, the place. So it looks like that is kind of the end of our little journey around the town here. Yep, for the moment. Until we defeat that darkness tentacle. Oh, that guy's oh, back. Wait, that guy's back. Yeah, run, run, run. Nice. So we will huh, work okay. on yeah. this darkness tentacle in the next episode. Possibly rescue Bowser, or possibly just leave him there and just. Yeah, he's waited this long. He can wait another episode. Yeah, right. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. Go ahead and go right chop that like button. Until next time, GG. Bye. GG!